guys so today I filmed this look for you guys it's sort of glamorous yet grungy and it's really mauvey and gray and charcoaly and gunmetally <laughs> and I absolutely love it I think it's so fun paired with this lip because it sort of took the glamorous eye look to a little bit of a grungy level which I absolutely love I love grungy makeup they're my favorite looks and I don't know what's going on with my hair, don't mind it. It's doing like a 1950s sort of weird wave naturally in my hair, so I'm just working with it. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed this look. I used all new products that I've never tried out before, so it was fun to try out all these products. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this look, and if you guys want to stick around and see how I got it, then just keep on watching. I'm going into the Tarte Cosmetics Tarlet in Bloom Palette, and I'm picking up Sweetheart first. So I'm just blending this shadow through my crease with my Sigma E25 blending brush and this is such a beautiful peachy pink shadow. It's going to really complement that lid shadow. Now to add some depth and darkness through my crease, I'm picking up Smoke Show. And now on the tip of the same brush, I just picked up this shadow and now I'm going to start really using a light hand to start applying this shadow through my crease. So it's going to look kind of crazy at first, but just keep on blending and don't worry, it'll look so good. Just windshield wiper motions and then little circular motions to further blend that out. And now picking up Sweetheart again on this brush, I'm now going to start really buffing this out and bringing back that slight peachiness. And now just to add a little bit of darkness on the outer corner and inner corner, I'm just picking up Smoke Show and applying that with my Sigma E54 Medium Sweeper Brush. I'm now picking up Tarte Cosmetics Tardis Metallic Eyeshadow in Grind. So now I'm picking up the shadow of my Sigma E58 cream color brush and I'm just going to start applying this on the outer corner over top of where I applied Smoke Show and inner corner. It's just such a beautiful shimmery gunmetal shadow. Now for the center of my lid, I'm picking up Tarte Cosmetics Tardis Metallic Shadow in Poker Face. So now I picked up the shadow on the Sigma E58 cream color brush again. Now I'm patting that over the center. So now I'm going to start running Sweetheart down on my lower lash line first. This is such a beautiful shadow. And then I'm picking up Smoke Show and I'm going to really just start defining this lower lash line and make it really nice and smoky. And make this lower lash line really smoky. To highlight my brow bone, I'm picking up Charmer. And now with my Zoeva Luxe 234 Smoky Shader Brush, I'm going to start applying the shadow on my brow bone. And then just lightly blend that down just to clean up the edges if I went a little bit too far with that crease shadow. To line my waterline and tight line, I'm picking up Tarte Cosmetics Tardis Double Take Eyeliner and I'm using the pencil side. And now I'm going to line my waterline and tight line just to create a thicker sort of darker base to my lashes and really just give this a sultry and more smokier look. And now I'm just going to apply some mascara and falsies, and the lashes that I'm using are these Tarte Cosmetics Tardis Pro Lashes in Goddess. And I'll be right back to show you the finished look. And that's the eye look done. Okay, so now moving on to lips. I'm so excited to use this shade because I feel like it's such a cool sort of like mauve purple gray shade, and I'm super excited to try this. So this is the Tarte Cosmetics Tardis Lip Paint in Rave. I love the name too. I think it's really cool. So... I feel like it's going to match the look so well, so now I'm just going to apply this all over the lips. They have such like a minty smell. I love it. I think it's really cool. Some people might not like it, but I think it's pretty cool. So now that the lipstick is on, a lot of you guys commented that you wanted to see how I apply my highlighter. So I have been thinking that I want to start adding on some of my face routine stuff and how I apply maybe my bronzer and my contour and highlight and blush once in a while if I'm trying something new out. So today I'm actually going to be trying out the Tarte Cosmetics Exposed Highlight. I actually did wear this a few times. I wore it I think twice. So I just really wanted to keep playing around with it because it's just so beautiful. So I'm going in picking this up with the <laughs> Sigma Beauty Strobing F42 Fan Brush. Oh, guys, I've mentioned how much I love this brush. You need it. It's absolutely amazing. So all I'm going to do is just swirl this in here, tap off the excess, and 
Let's see how this is. Yes! Ooh, that is stunning. And I mean, I don't apply just one layer of highlight. I go in on that highlight, girl. That is, oh, it's so pretty. So this is the finished look of my gray and pink halo smoky eye paired with a gray purple lip. I hope you guys enjoyed. I don't know why I think these two shadows on my lid are just so complementing of each other. The pink shadow is just, it's, I don't know, it's like a pink, but it still has that little bit of mauviness and grayness in it that just like complements the other shadows so nicely. So that's why I paired it in the middle. I just thought it would like completely transform the look and make it look so cool. And I love it. And this lipstick, guys, you need it. Formula is amazing. It's not drying because Tarte Cosmetics lip paints are sort of like cream, but they're so pigmented. They're beautiful. Like, I mean, this was like almost one swipe, but I always apply a second layer over top of any liquid lipstick, even if it's pigmented on the first try. I'm going over with the top layer. <laughs> so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this look and don't forget to let me know what other looks you guys want to see down in the comments below. Also, I want to mention to you guys that I'm going to Gen Beauty. I am so excited. I will be there on Sunday only. So I think it's September 18th on Sunday. Let's double check that. And yes, yeah, September 18th on Sunday, I will be at Gen Beauty in New York City. I'm so excited. I hope to see all of you there or some of you there and if you're going let me know so we can all meet up and say hi to each other and take selfies and hugs and all the good stuff. <laughs> so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this look and if you guys want to follow me on Snapchat, Instagram, and Twitter, that'll be right here as well as down in the description box and also a list of all the products that I used today will obviously be down in the description box and that should be it. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!